GMC is looking for a new ball carrier for its high school football team. Head coach Steven Simpson joins 41 NBC's Bill Shanks in the coach's corner to talk about this year's season. Anytime a head coach comes in here and he's trying to replace a running back, that's not always the easiest thing to do. Steven Simpson's with us from GMC. Uh, the Bulldogs lost T.J. Lowe, 1,700-yard rusher last year. You kind of had to be a little scared about that situation going into the summer? Yeah, it's always tough to replace an incredible athlete like that. Um, no matter who comes in, they're going to have to try to live up to it. And yeah. Our depth there is a little bit of an issue for us, but we got several guys going to take that role. So who are the options? Who are the players you're looking to step up? Marino McDonald is going to be a senior. He's played some there in the past. Uh, a young man named Alex Easley. He's a track guy that's played in the past. And mm -hmm. um, Hunter Moody. We would think between the three of those at tailback, we'll be okay. And then we have a, a fullback named Michael Skinner. His first year at the school. Um, it's going to be a pretty good player for us. And your quarterback, Tyler McCarty, is coming back. How much will that help? <clears throat> that's a tremendous help for us. I mean, he's got command of our offense. He's been in it for two years now as a starter. Um, and he can get us in the good plays out of the bad ones, we hope. Mm -hmm. uh, he's been doing a good job so far of it in camp. And Devin Hill is your main lineman. How's your all overall offensive line? Offensive line is going to be one of our stronger uh, groups this year, I believe. Devin Hill's coming back. Um, he's a big kid. He's been a four-year starter for us. And we're returning four other starters. So we're bringing back five offensive linemen that started for us last year. Which is, be is, is it going to take you a little time for those kids to, to kind of get acclimated? I mean, you, may you not know about your offense until October compared to September? You're probably right. Well, by the time the um, offensive line jails with, and the running backs jail and understand where all the fits and things are. It's going to take us a little while to get started, but mm -hmm. I feel like once we get it all together, we're going to be able to click on offense. And, that, and we kind of go full circle back to that quarterback. I mean, McCarty's really got to step up because, like it or not, when that kind of situation is in play, the quarterback has to lead. Can he do that? Yeah, he's a very strong leader. Um, got great command in the huddle, great command in the locker room. Kids really follow him. So, I mean, that's that's probably the best part of what we got going right now as far as trying to get in the right direction as Tyler does a great job leading us. All right, that's the offense. The defense has a lot of changes as well with only three players back. We'll talk about that with Coach Simpson in our next report.